a great message there. Now to our story on wild elephants in southwest China's Yunnan province. A herd of 15 elephants is still on the move through Hongtai district of Wuxi city. There have been reports of over 400 incidents of the elephants damaging farmland and houses since they left their natural habitat in Xishuangban last year. CGTN's reporter Ma Ke is at the scene. Traveling farmland, breaking into stores and houses. The elephants' behavior has become bolder as they enter more populated areas of Yunnan. Five members of the herd has broken into this villager's barn. As you can see, they've knocked down the gate. If we take a closer look, here's a, a giant footprint on the gate. And uh, as they enter the gate, you can see their giant body has grazed through the roof. <laughs> We were sleeping in the attic. At around 1 o'clock in the morning, we heard noises. I looked through the window and saw two adult elephants in the yard. They then called other elephants to eat too. I called the village head. He told me, don't move, don't make a sound. This is the latest incident of the elephants invading areas inhabited by humans and destroying buildings and eating crops. The animals left their natural habitat in Xishuangbanna last March in search of food. And since then, they found human settlements provide the best option. They stepped on my rice field first, but there was nothing to eat. So they went up and found my barn and ate my grains. The family of nine adults and six calves are now on a generally northward route towards the provincial capital of Kunming. This has ignited fierce debate online. Some are calling for the elephants to be put down before they cause more damage. Others argue against it. We've considered a lot about how to lead them away from residential areas. It's not recommended at the current state to use force, since it will lead to injuries, even death, of both people and elephants. Currently, we're considering using food to guide them back to the spots where they usually find food during this time of the year. The number of wild Asian elephants has grown from under 200 to around 300 in 30 years due to the establishment of natural reserves. Human-elephant conflict is not uncommon in Yunnan. Ten out of 11 natural reserves in the province have high forest density. With more animals moving in and competing for food, more elephants are forced out of the reserves. Just like this herd. Ma Ke, CGTN, Yuxi.